We're going to demonstrate how to test your Cat5 cable for continuity using this inexpensive network testing tool. You can pick up a little network tester like this for under $100 and while it will work on a multitude of types of wires like coaxial cable, telephone wire, as well as Ethernet cable, for today's video we're going to focus on using Cat5 and we're also going to share some tips for what this tool will help you do. The tool is actually comprised of two parts. The yellow part on the right sits in the base of the part on the left. I went ahead and joined the two pieces now let's go ahead and test a cable. Testing a cable is pretty straightforward. Plug one end of your wire into the RJ45 jack located at the top of the tester. Now simply plug the other end of the wire into the bottom of the tester in that RJ45 jack. And to demonstrate the two-piece configuration of this particular tool we went ahead and removed that base portion outside you'll be able to use this at the other end of an extremely long wire run which could be up to a thousand feet away. Now we simply press the network button and look at the test results on the screen. In this particular case we have a pass. Cat5 is comprised of eight conductors so we show the numbers one through eight on the top row and the numbers one through eight on the bottom row. This signifies a pass. One option for using this tool, if you have an RJ45 jack located in a room of a building and you want to check continuity or help to trace out that particular wire, you simply plug in a Cat5 patch cord or a Cat5e patch cord into that wall jack and then the other end of that cable goes into that little yellow device I showed you earlier in the video. You would then come back to the head end of that wire, whether it's at your router or a network box, Plug the end that you think belongs to that jack into the tester tool and look for the pass. In this case we have a pass. All eight conductors on both ends, the continuity checks out. 